In this video, we will guide you through how to set up your printer. Firstly, open the door at the front of the printer. Remove the blue die film cassette using the small handle at the front. And do the same with the grey cassette. Install the retransfer film as shown, placing the dark grey spool on the grey end cap and feed the film round so the blue spool sits on the blue end cap. Wind the film until the clear part of the film is visible. The die film fits in a similar way. Ensure the matching spool and end caps fit together like this. Again, wind the film on so the coloured panels of the die film are visible. Now you can place the die film cassettes back into place as shown. Next, take the tacky roller and metal shaft. Place the shaft inside the tacky roller. Leaving the sticky cover attached, flip down the tacky roller bracket and place the roller and shaft inside the printer like this. Now you can remove the sticky cover by pulling the yellow tab. Now close the tacky roller bracket. Now flip the lid on the input hopper and place your cards inside. You can then slot the hopper back into place at the top side of your Ultima printer. The output stacker slots into place like this. Now you can follow the driver install. Head to www.magicard.com Click on support, then select the printer you are using. Search for the driver that matches your printer. Once downloaded, you can follow on-screen instructions to install the driver. you will then be prompted to register your printer. We strongly recommend doing this in order to be able to make full use of the warranty. At this point, you can remove the sticker covering the ports at the back of the printer and attach both the USB cable and power supply. Then turn the printer on. Now connect the printer to your computer via the USB cable. On your computer, go to Control Panel, Devices and Printers. Right click on the correct printer icon and go to Printing Preferences. Then go to Printer Status to check the computer has acknowledged the printer being connected. Your Ultima printer is now ready to start printing. 